It seems to me, whenever there's new technology, there's always someone out there who wants to question its effectiveness. Just the other day, a bloke told me, you can't fit electric caravan movers to a dual axle van. I figured that if there's one bloke who could bust these myths, then it would have to be Malcolm Hill, the owner of Purple Line. Purple Line makes Australia's most advanced caravan mover, the Ego. Yeah, well, we do hear quite often that you can't fit caravan movers to dual axle caravans, but the truth of the matter is that we actually fit 100 of these every year. The second one is the opposite of the first one, that you don't need to fit caravan movers to lightweight vans. Well, when was the last time you saw someone successfully pushing even a small caravan up a small slope? And they tell me they don't fit Aussie vans. Now, is that another myth, Malcolm? Absolutely. We fit hundreds of these every year. And what about European vans? European vans, camper trailers, just about anything really. So it's not a case of one size fits all? No, it's not. We've actually got our three main models, all for different applications. Firstly, we've got the Ego Titanium. Features a simple over-centre cam engager. It's a real all-rounder. So what about the larger dual axle vans? Well, for them, we have the Ego Platinum with its uh, wind-on engagement mechanism and larger roller. Ideal for caravans with bigger tyres and uh, independent suspensions, rock and roll suspensions, things like that. Well, the Ego Quickies, quick release model caravan mover. Um, so it's got a simple release pin, so you pull that out and you can lift the motors off the caravan. Some people tell me that you can't fit a caravan mover in front of or behind the wheels. Now, is that another myth? Absolutely, that really is a myth. For example, a dual axle caravan, you have to fit one in front and one behind the axle. Okay, so why wouldn't a powered jockey wheel do the same thing? Well, a powered jockey wheel, it only carries about 10% of the weight of your caravan on the jockey wheel. So on a loose or slippery surface, uh, or a sloping surface, you could lose traction. Always good to hear from someone who knows what he's talking about. Thanks, Fred.